Hello and welcome to the Daily Comic and Collectible, episode 232. Now today, the collectible of the day is the Mezco Toys, 112 Collective, DC Comics, Flash Action Figure, The Fastest Man Alive, The Scarlet Speedster, The Crimson Comet, All of Them One Man, The Flash. When police scientist Barry Allen is doused by chemicals during a freak accident, he finds himself transformed into Central City's greatest crime fighter, the Flash. With the ability to manipulate the speed force, not only can he run, think, and react at the speed of light, but he can vibrate so fast he's able to pass through solid objects as well. Meticulously developed to capture the Flash's heroic look, this figure is on the Mezco hyper-articulated body, featuring over 32 points of articulation, intricate head sculpts, incredible costume detailing, and lots of accessories. The final result is a seamless blend of a timeless comic book icon with a real-world look. This Mezco figure features fabric costume with special silk screening applications, including logo and footwear hyper-realistic head sculpts, and comes in a fifth panel window box. Box includes figure, two head sculpts, six interchangeable hands, speed force lightning arm and leg attachments, tornado hand attachment, and display base with posing post. Figure comes hand-painted and intricately detailed by Mezco Toys. Now, the comic of the day is Flashpoint, number one, volume two with a cover date of July 2011, with story by Jeff Johns, art by Adam Kubert, and cover by Adam Kubert. This issue came in the exclusive Page Punchers comic and minifigure set released by McFarlane Toys in 2022. Waking up suddenly at his desk, he only has a few seconds to realize something in his work environment's changed. Before he hears that Miss Alchemy is committing a felony. He runs to get there and falls down the stairs. Barry is confused over this, and even more so when he gets up and sees Nora Allen, his mother greeting him, who stopped by for a visit. He's also visited by Professor Zoom, who has retained his powers, despite Barry losing his. Elsewhere, the cyborg has called an assembly of the world's greatest superheroes to try dealing with the situation in Europe, where the Amazons are set to go to war with Atlantis's newly acquired continental territories. The assembled heroes drag their heels, but Cyborg finally gets a vote. Back in Central City, Barry begins quizzing his mother about how much the world has changed. Whatever happened, she has no notion of Superman or of the Flash, but she has heard of Batman and of Gotham City. Meanwhile, in Gotham, a shadowy figure chases a colorful criminal across the rooftops. The Batman chases Yo-Yo for the location of the Joker. Meanwhile, from his superhero career, Barry Allen knows the location of the Batcave, but is shocked at all the changes made in the cave. In place of trophies and evidence, there's only bats. Where Jason Todd's Robin costume used to stand, there is only a gun on a stand. Suddenly, Batman arrives and begins breaking him up. Barry tries calming him down by calling him Bruce, but it doesn't have the desired effect. After seeing a Wayne family portrait, by process of elimination, he arrives at a new conclusion. Bruce's father, Thomas Wayne, is the Batman. And somehow, the world has changed almost beyond recognition. This story is continued in Flashpoint, Chapter 2. Geek Fact Flashpoint is the core story of the reboot event that occurred in 2011 that ended the continuity of New Earth and starts Prime Earth and the New 52. Bonus Geek Fact Flashpoint was a limited series that had a total of five issues that ran from July through October of 2011. There was also a crossover series called Flash, Flashpoint. 
And final geek fact. Which superhero first appeared in a Flash comic? Answer, the elongated man. In fact, Barry was also the best man at his wedding. Well, I'd like to thank you for joining me for today's Daily Comic and Collectible, and I hope to see you again tomorrow. This is Cat Fan Comics Man, and I'll catch you on the flip. Over and out.